And you know, Thanksgiving and Christmas uh, not too far away with the holidays right around the corners. You start making your plans on whether or not to travel and see family this year. Our Haley Harrison's on your side tonight with the latest on one factor that may affect your decision on what to do during the holidays. COVID-19 booster shots. Before turkeys go into the oven this Thanksgiving, based on a handful of responses to a tweet, there seems to be a divide on whether locals will choose to get a COVID-19 booster shot once they qualify. One month ago, Pfizer boosters were recommended by the FDA for certain categories of people, including those 65 years and older and those 18 and older with underlying medical conditions. A doctor who heads up local vaccine trials says, all three vaccines allowed in the United States have data showing increased antibodies with an extra dose. The question is whether or not clinical infections and hospitalizations and deaths drop due to the vaccine third dose or the second dose as the case may be. And that's why the FDA, in, in my opinion, did a good job by saying, hey, let's take a deep breath. Let's find out if the boosters really are needed and are effective. Dr. Michael Quorum predicts more data will be coming out about the Pfizer booster in two to three weeks. And then within three weeks after that, the FDA will make a formal recommendation about boosters for everyone. Quorum says not to worry if boosters aren't an option for you before Thanksgiving. He recommends to continue taking other precautions like masking and social distancing. We're still seeing that the people who get really sick from COVID are the ones who are unvaccinated. And that should really be the focus. If there are still unvaccinated people out there, please get vaccinated. It really it really makes a difference. You're protecting yourself. You're protecting your family. I'm Healy Harrison, First Coast News on your side. Now, Dr. Corrin says studies are also beginning for boosters that are specific to the new variants. In fact, Jacksonville Center for Clinical Research is launching a trial with Moderna boosters, and that includes Delta and Beta specific booster shots.